another one that people told me they really wanted me to cover in this class was removing reflections and glasses. Now, there's a right way to do it, and then there's the, oh no, it's too late way to do it. If you have a reflection in both glasses, you're pretty much sunk because there's no, you'd have to rebuild the eye. There is no tool that just removes the glare and there's the eye. I wish that was the case. Uh, you can always try dehaze. I haven't had it work really good yet, but let's go ahead and give it a shot. You can see the image here. Filter, camera raw filter. You can see the reflection from the light. It's actually greenish even. Let's go to the adjustment brush. Let's turn up the, the dehaze quite a bit. It's not looking good. A little dehaze isn't helping. A lot of dehaze isn't helping. It's just bad. Okay, so what do we do? Well, here's what you can do. If you're in the shoot and you see a reflection in the eyes, of course, there are things you can do with the light and stuff, but if you have the light the way you want it, you're getting a reflection, do this. Get your subject to take, take their picture and tell them, once we take the picture, stay still for a second and have an assistant or a friend or even yourself walk over and simply take their glasses off. So it's click, click, you take two pictures, one with the glasses on and all the reflection and one without it. If you get that, the rest is absolutely simple in Photoshop, watch. So here's the image with the glasses on and then of course we asked them to take one without it. Select the one without it, copy it, simple copy and paste, copy, over here and paste. Now they don't line up, right? Of course not. So select both layers and choose what? Auto align layers. Oh yeah. Choose auto align layers. Make sure auto is selected. Click OK and in two seconds it lines up. All right now let's take the top layer and option click on the layer mask icon, the third icon from the bottom. Option click on Mac, alt click on Windows. It hides the version of his eyes behind a layer mask. All you do now is this. Since the mask is in black, you're going to paint the opposite color white. You're just going to go in here and paint his eyes in. And the reflection is gone. That's all there is to it. So if you do a little tiny bit of prep work, it works awesome. Now, if there was one eye, let's just undo an eye like that. Let's say that there was one eye that was okay. You could flip this. You'll see this in a little, in a little later because we're going to talk about when one eye is open more than the other, how to fix it. And you can use that technique I'm going to show you then. But honestly, if you do this one up front, so easy. Make sure